welcome back to the channel it's been a, a minute since i've uploaded a video um, some of it's been i've been under the weather and part of it has been uh, been busy in the shop working on stuff some of that make it on the video some of it won't um, I'm gonna try not to bore y'all to death got a future gate opener here uh, he's homeschooled so he's getting trained on how to open the gate up today and so far he has failed We'll bring you back with some cows somewhere. fed the cows down there in the valley kind of a windbreak because it is 22 degrees today this tractor's roasting but uh it's not very nice on the outside we're not used to that here so we're just checking everything out got two dandy heifers right there black baldies Uh, so we're going to go over here and check these out over here. Good looking old cow right there. Some more good looking ones. I think everything looks to be in order here. So let's go feed some more hay. What we have here is frozen mud. It's rough to ride on right now. But as soon as this crap thaws out, it's gonna be messy. So we had uh, probably it's been probably about two inches of snow Sunday, but the temperature never got over 34 degrees. And uh, then we had an inch and a half of rain uh, two days ago. So the ground saturated and uh, kind of glad it is froze but it's going to be a mess when it falls out. So these cows still have about a half a row. you can see all this right here, it'd just be a muddy mess if it wasn't frozen. Get these dumped off and we'll go look at these cows then. They're still grazing around and no, I'm not going to apologize for the dirty windows. Because it's too freaking cold to be washing on them. One thing me and dad was talking about we need to start culling some of these older ones and uh get some newer cows in here younger cows maybe we'll work on that this this winter well we took a little small trip yesterday uh dad bought something he'd been wanting for a while and if you've been with me for a while, you'll know what I'm talking about. Put your guesses in the comments. Well, they are out grazing, but let's see this hay. I'm like the Pied Piper. 
Um, after we get this done, we're gonna go cold start to Peterbilt, so stay tuned for that. See if it will crank. But uh, I've gotta run it up to the store and get some go-go juice in it. I've got nine loads of uh, corn to haul next week. And I'm satisfied to say, exception with the exception of 2007, it's the highest corn I've ever sold. So let's drop these off right here in a new spot. And we'll go look at some cow. Old horn cow there. Let me adjust y'all up a little bit. Let's go look at some cash. So we got a new one here. It's feeling its oats. There's a little frisky fella there. Where all the cool kids hang out it's over here. And right there needs to go. Well, he's gonna get off here and close this gate and uh, we'll bring you back after lunch trying to crank this Peterbilt. We're at 29 degrees, let's do a cold start on this putter belt whoops like it's gonna be have to be jumped off so that was a fail um it's gonna be up in the 40s tomorrow i don't know what it'll be in the morning but uh I don't have any jumper cables. They're in dad's truck and he's not here. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. Maybe a short one, but uh, thank you for watching. Uh, hope to have a few more videos out more often in the upcoming weeks. Uh, I'm gonna be hauling nine loads of grain. I think I've done said that. Really good price on it right now. So I might be hauling more than that later on, but uh, thank you for watching. God bless you. Leave me a comment, and we'll catch you on the next one.